What I want to do in this video is think about how does the circumference and how does the area of a circle change as we change its radius. And in particular, we'll focus on what happens when we double its radius. So let's think about a circle right over here. So this is a circle. And let's say its radius is x units, whatever our units is. So this distance right over here is x. And then let's think about another circle that has twice the radius. So its radius will be 2x. And so let me draw its radius first so I get so it looks roughly accurate. So this is 2x is this circle's radius. And so the circle might look something like that. That's my best attempt at freehand drawing a circle. So let's just think about what the circumference of both of these are and what the areas of both of these are. So the circumference of any circle is 2 pi times the radius. So in this case, the circumference, and I'll use c for circumference, is equal to 2 pi times the radius, which in this case is x. Well, what's the circumference here? Well, once again, the circumference is equal to 2 pi times the radius, but this time the radius is 2x. So the circumference is equal to 2 times pi times 2 times x, which is the same thing as 2 times 2 times pi times x, or we could write it as 4 pi x. So we see here that this circumference is twice as large as this one. To go from 2 pi x to 4 pi x, you have to multiply, multiply by 2. So you double the radius, it doubled the circumference. Now what about the area? And I'll do area in a new color. So we already know that area is equal to pi r squared. In this circle, the radius is of length x. So it's pi times x squared. In this circle right over here, the area is going to be equal to pi times the radius squared, but now the radius is 2x, 2x squared. Now what is this going to be equal to? Well, our area is equal to pi 2x squared is 2x times 2x, which is the same thing as 4x squared, 4x squared. Or we could rewrite this as area is equal to 4 pi x squared. Notice, now the area has increased not by a factor of 2, the area has increased by a factor, a factor of 4 when we doubled the radius. Now why did this happen? I encourage you to pause the video and think about it. Well, it comes straight out of the formulas for circumference and area. Remember, circumference is equal to 2 pi r, while area, while area, let me do this in a different color, while area, area is equal to pi r squared. So you see here, area is proportional to the square of the radius. So if you double this, you're going to increase your area by a factor of 4. If you triple it, if you triple your radius, you're going to increase your area by a factor of 9. If you increase your radius by a factor of 4, you're going to increase your area by a factor of 4 squared, or 16. While circumference, whatever factor you increase your radius, the circumference is going to increase by that same factor. And if you don't believe me, I mean, we essentially showed it right here through a little bit of algebra, but you could try it out with as many numbers as you see fit.